In this video, Boating Local travels to the town of Hingham, Massachusetts, located just south of Boston. Hingham offers a host of boating amenities and lots of great places to visit by water. We'll begin our tour at World's End at the far eastern end of Hingham Harbor. Owned by the trustees of the reservations, World's End features miles of walking trails and great views of Hingham Bay and the Weir River to the east, which also happens to be a great place to explore in a dinghy, skiff, or kayak. Several town-managed moorings are available on the eastern side of the World's End Peninsula as well. West of World's End, on the Inner Harbor and just off Route 3A, is the Lincoln Maritime Center, which offers community sailing and rowing programs. The center maintains a large fleet of sail and rowing craft and is open to boaters of all ages. Continuing east along the Inner Harbor, you'll pass the Hingham Harbor Marina and Bear Cove Marina, located next to the Harbor Master's office and the town landing. The landing offers free tie-up for 15 minutes, depending on available space, and charges $15 per hour after that. Transient boaters can also rent a mooring in the harbor for $35 a night. The town beach and launch ramp are located just east of the landing, where you'll find plenty of free parking and access to the Inner Harbor, except at low tide. launch ramp. It's a free launch ramp with 30, uh, 32 spaces for trailer parking. It's a, it's a good launch ramp. It's not very crowded, especially on weekdays, but the one thing you have to watch out for, on the last two hours of the outgoing and the first two hours of the incoming, it could be tricky to get your boat in here. You can have no problem with kayaks and jet skis probably, but you can see there's a, a little, there's a lip uh, at the end of the uh, at the end of the slab where it drops off and you can easily there's a big hole there You can easily get your tires stuck if you run off the edge of that and uh, do some damage to your trailer So keep in mind if you got a, a larger boat don't try to bring it in here on the lower stage The Hingham town landing and launch ramp afford easy access to the downtown area just across busy route 3a from the landing is stars restaurant a popular dining spot the Liberty Grill is another Hingham eatery, and behind that is the upscale Tosca's restaurant. A short walk down North Street will bring you to Hingham Square and a host of shops and more dining establishments, including the Snug, a historic and homey Irish pub that serves lunch and dinner. While there's lots to do and see on land, there's even more available in the waters off Hingham. Just be sure to follow the winding channel carefully as it snakes through the islands in the shallow mud flats of the harbor, where many a boater has found himself hard aground for several hours. A cruise through the harbor will bring you past lots of interesting and beautiful vessels moored among the small islands, which can be accessed by small boat or kayak. The Hingham Yacht Club on Crow Point guards the western entrance to the harbor from Hingham Bay. From here, it's a short run to Boston Harbor and the Harbor Islands National Park. Several of the islands have public docks and moorings, and you can even camp on Grape and Bumpkin Islands, both of which are very close to Hingham. Hingham's waterfront continues inside the Weymouth River. Here you'll find the Hingham Shipyard Marina, a massive new complex offering transient slips, 
fuel, and a host of boating services, shops, five restaurants, a cinema multiplex, and commuter boat access to Boston. Farther along the river is Stodder's Neck Park, a popular dog walking area. A small anchorage lies opposite the park on the other side of the channel. And lastly, we come to the Weymouth Lawn Tramp, an excellent double ramp with lots of parking, good access on all tides, and a pair of courtesy floats. This is also where we'll conclude our mini tour of Hingham. Hope it was useful, and that you'll consider bringing your own boat to Hingham to see what this great boating destination is all about.